Hey everyone, so a little uh, update on the cute kittens in the backyard. Here they are. Um, this one's a little climber right here, and they're very, very vocal. As we can see here, there's five of them, and they really want out of the cage. They fortunately look healthy. They don't have any sort of infections visible or anything like that. And they were dropped off, like I said, just the other night uh, in the backyard over the fence inside this crate. And um, it looks like we, uh, we being the people in the uh, community here, have found uh, uh, homes for at least a couple of them, and I'm sure we'll find solutions for the rest. I'm thinking maybe the Dearborn Animal Shelter should be able to take care of them, the same place where we uh, adopted Lucy the cat. So that could be a really nice thing, but it's just amazing how coincidences can happen sometimes when you have uh, a cat on the way out, a baby on the way in, and all these kittens here, and at least in my own head, my own little universe I live in, it's... Just really uh, amazing how life can work out sometimes, but I guess a little cinema magic to the next scene. All right, now we're in my glorious kitchen uh, that's completely messy, so please don't judge, but hey, look at this. I made a little uh, cat litter box uh, for the cats in that crate out there, so they have a little spot to do their business, and I'm going to put some fresh new towels down below because uh, they've only been here since last night. Yeah, it's already getting pretty dirty in there, so I cleaned up their food bowl, gave them some fresh water, and... I gotta get back over to see um, my cat over at Irina's house in just a little while here because uh, well, I gotta take care of Lucy and, and, and watch Lucy while Irina can go out and do what she needs to get done today. And then I'll uh, continue with the rest of my day and finish up what I have to do um, around in uh, my new home and uh, up near my mother's house and all the things that need to get done need to get done. And uh, I'm lucky to be able to have the opportunity to uh, have been Lucy's human for as long as I've been. And, uh, and to take care of these new cats and look forward to all the positive changes going on in my life, like the new house and the baby on the way and all that. So let's do a little cinema magic because less talking to this camera and more getting things done uh, will be a lot more beneficial to what needs immediate attention. So cinema magic, skip to the next scene right about now. And now we're here at the house with Lucy and Lucy and I are just chilling. Lucy's taking a little nap right now. She's really tired after the after the biopsy and the surgery and all that. And uh, it looks like her days are numbered like all of ours are, but she might have to be uh, leaving us uh, sometime the next couple weeks. Uh, but we'll know when the biopsy comes in what our options really are. But we suspect with our best judgment and with the resources we have, with the uh, vet techs we know, that um, it might just be a good idea to let her sleep. And we might have to end up doing that. So uh, that's where we're at with this. She's had a really great life so far and provided us a lot of joy. You just want her to be comfortable. You don't want her to be, to be suffering or anything like that. So that's where we're at right now. Um, I'm going to be watching her for the next couple hours, so we're going to have some alone time. And after that, I'm going to spend some time with my, with my girlfriend because I've um, been so busy that we haven't had the opportunity to see each other. She's also very busy, too. She's a very busy woman. Uh, but tonight we're going to have a nice date night and have some food and... Maybe snuggle up and watch a movie together and, and who knows, maybe uh, look at baby things or something online. That might be really good therapy for both of us. But uh, this is where I leave you. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it very much. Uh, a lot of stuff going on. A lot of great things happening. And, you know, you can't have enough without a doubt, I guess. So, and I'll end the video the way I've been ending most all my videos lately. Uh, remember to never give up and to do your best and to stay true to yourself and to be amazing. So um, I'll see you in the next video, folks. Thanks again for watching, and bye-bye.